Christmas. A day that's supposed to be the celebrate the birth of Jesus. Jesus of Nazareth. The Christian religion. Now at the same Jesus of Nazareth. There been a disciple of Pythagoras. There is an unable link between the Pythagoreans. They've been vegan, plant-based, and the Nazareans. Therefore, it is impossible that me that Jesus supports the meat eating because. Also, think about this. His mother, Maria, was com was pure, and so you have to be pure to be the mother of Jesus. Sin free, thou shalt not kill. The most, yet most important, but most. Misunderstand of all the ten commandments. The statement to that commandment only uh, if it be a human or if it be have feather sphere or feather, it is okay. So, also. Why not then, just like Jesus have done, actually go vegan? This is time for peace, time for com for compassion, and a time for togetherness. Sitting around on table and eating some dead animal parts. That's not some great thing to celebrate one day of peace and compassion just a day that's how you celebrate and peace of selfishness and arrogance and arrogance and psychopathic peace begins on the dinner table by what you eat on a daily basis, you don't get pray for peace and then do hypocritical final things. That's not how the world works. Peace for people don't participate in cruel rituals that have been based on bloodshed. The animals, they have a life, they have a family. They don't want to be your food, just like you don't want to be their food. Please do what the Jesus have said in the, in the Apostle of the Nazareus. Jesus said, Be careful for who want to be my disciple. Hold your hands from bloodshed and let no meat enter your mouth. The have the Lord not said that we have to live with uh, on the plants and the seeds and the fruits of the earth? Genesis 1.29 God's first time and laws. I give you any fruit and any plant on the earth, on the face of the earth. This for you and being healthy in my life. Just like not to want to do next set of commandments about any animal eating. And the last one sheep will be with the wolf, one bear will, well, a bear will eat. Uh, one uh, lion will eat.
it throw like the us and that little child will let and nobody wants kill on my roll on my holy mountain. And think about this also. You believe in God. No matter in which kind of form. You call them Allah or you call them Yahweh or you call them um, Vishnu or you call them um, you call them Ishnami or Ishnafi. They have all created the earth, the planet and the earth. And the, and the and the earth, the animal, other animals, and the humans. So if you murder animals, the humans, and the, or, or the earth, you murder in God. So go a vegan. Don't participate in cruelty. There is not such thing. As we may murder, uh, slaughter, artificial insemination, rape, or something like that. The definition of um, yeah, of humane is actually that you want that somebody do it also to you. Since nobody in the whole world wants to be treated the animal like the animals in the Animal concentration camp, which we so euphemistically call slaughterhouses. It is more than logical to become vegan. Live by the golden rule. Do to others just like you want that they are do to you. Is also what Jesus wants that you do, or other uh, other uh, religions, and most atheists also think that it's a pretty right way to live. Universal compassion to all innocent beings is the only guarantee of morality. As long as we don't destroy speciesism, the first form of hatred, people being told, we uh, have no peace on this world. This is the first form of hatred, people being told. I have a video also uh, where I explain that. It is there in the description below. And Live just by golden rule. Good people oppose discrimination and haters, no matter which kind of her, to which kind of creature this be. What you say? You don't deserve rights. You don't be willing to extend rights to other living beings. It's pretty insane, you think not? Giving rights to cruel individuals that don't be willing to extend rights to others. Seems to me a little bit insane. It is not your right, based on your traditions, to deny other animals their freedoms. If you can harm or slave them, turn them into objects like TV, sex, and cell phones, like iPads, like computers, or other things like that. No, that's not what rights mean. That's what 
Ik moet daarvoor doen. Toen we nog liggen. Want creature that is superior of her. Don't treat other living beings like shit, like dirt, like inanimate objects that treat them and give them the respect that they deserve. Merry Christmas.